Hello guys, what's up? I'm Surush Designer. In this tutorial I'm going to talk about how we can model some type of toilet in SketchUp. So, for modeling some objects like the toilet or other type of things, you need to use some type of lines and diamonds about the two-point arc much more than the past. So, I'm going to start with the rectangle on here. So, I'm going to draw some type of rectangle with some dimension like this. I want to reshape it so I'm going to use two point arc in this point. Dimensions is not important because this is your tutorial. You can use the exact dimensions in your 3D modelings. Now I'm going to extrude this a little bit to the upside and now I want a little bit outside offset for it. So I'm going to use this type of outside offset, something like that, another one and as you can see I'm gonna press Ctrl Z in here and another offset to the inner point another time I'm gonna extrude my face so now I want to create some type of flash tank button in here so I'm gonna use the offset option to create my flash tank I'm gonna move these edges to the right side or the left side it depends on you something like that and now you can extrude it a little bit, something like the uh, push or pull option. And this is the flash tank button for your toilet. As you can see, something like that. Alright, I'm going to click on it and create some type of group of it. I'm going to create some type of face for it. For this reason, I can explode this model, copy this face on the blue axis and convert it to the group. Now I want to use push or pull option in here and extrude a little bit something like the uh, hand place for our toilet something like that as you can see I can another time extrude this option something like this and another time I can select these edges for my toilet handle this is the water tank base as you can see in your houses or homes so uh, I'm gonna extrude it backside and convert it to the group very simple and easy so I'm gonna use this point and move it to the downstairs so now I want to create my main point of the toilet a place people sit on it so as you can see I'm gonna draw some type of box like this and now I want to use two point arc so my plan something like the uh, something like this for example it comes and some type of things like that has been created for us be careful to use these shape lines like this so now i want to select them click on the paint bucket in here and we have some option called the tenant info you can make your edges soft and smooth as you can see but it will hide so i don't suggest to use this but sometimes you can increase it completely direct without any type of dependence to the other lines so I'm gonna increase the segments for the smoother result in here now I'm gonna hold control on my keyboard and take some copy of this toilet so now I want to right click on it and flip it to the uh, green direction now I want to press move option again and hold this point and move it to this place as you can see we create this type of button station in here so uh, I'm gonna use extrude option a little bit something like this alright I think it's good for now or you can re-extrude it again and draw some type of profile for it for example I'm gonna draw some type of rectangle something like this and use two point arc in these points like that to create some type of shape for my line and model for this reason you can click on it and move it to this place now you can click on this this point and press the uh, follow me option and create some type of sink for your toilet so now I want to uh, use another thing so I'm gonna extrude this again something like that as you can see so uh, another time I must use this pass for the following for this reason I'm gonna draw another face 
or profile for my pass so I'm going to use the align option in here something like that for example something like this and something like this as you can see so uh, in this place I only want to make some type of a little bit curveness on my model and delete this line in here so I'm gonna use this pass for my 3d modeling and press follow me option so uh, as you can see we create this again and I can re-extrude it a little bit something like that so you can do these type of jobs in the uh, SketchUp very simple and easy but this one I think is okay so I'm gonna extrude it a little bit to the uh, midpoint or a little bit higher something like that and another time this one's too so as you can see I want to re-extrude it a little bit something like the door for example and I think everything is done in here so uh, I'm gonna click on it and convert it to the uh, another group in here so you can remove some type of extra lines in the uh, model very simple and easy and just that as you can see you create this model very simple and easy you can click on the uh, all of the uh, model click on the uh, soften edges and make your 3d model much softer than the uh, past so I hope you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe, don't forget it, please support us and goodbye.